Coming up next, it's a featherweight matchup between the Apex and knockout artist, Cub Swanson. Cub Swanson, the last graduating member of the WEC class to fight in the octagon. Swanson has always displayed outstanding striking skills. In fact, he has proven to have some of the best pure boxing in the division. Cub Swanson, always aggressive, always welcomes the stand-up game, and always is looking for a post-fight bonus. Cub Swanson has grown to become one of the most elite fighters in the world in the UFC's featherweight division. His ability to cover distance and his accuracy as well as the unpredictable nature of his attacks makes him amongst the elite of the featherweights in the UFC. The Apex, looking to prove once again that he's one of the best in the world. This guy has tremendous ground technique and his ability to pass guard and get to a dominant position is elite. For this featherweight fight, the American is 32, the Canadian is 35. Swanson will have a one-inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting at the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 22 wins, seven losses. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting at a Palm Springs, California, Cub Swanson! And now he comes to his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Montreal, Quebec, Canada, the And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. Dan Mergliata, our referee. Are you ready? You ready? And we fight. are underway. <laughs> fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Swanson. Black trunks for the Apex. Tags him. Nice turning side kick to the body. More great kicks from him here. Joe, another kick to the body by Swanson. They're going after it quick here. Swanson with a strong combination. Oh, my goodness, how quick was that, Joe? He's putting his hands down on the thighs. He's looking to pass. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Back to full guard, very nice. He keeps busy from the body. You can hear Greg Jackson in the corner of Cub Swanson reminding him to keep his hands up. He's got his back. It looks like he's going after a rear naked choke. He pops out of the rear naked choke. A mouth, the mouth. full mount, not good. The Apex gets side control. He transitions into north-south. Oh, looking for his back. Big what right hand. Huge right hand. Oh, some heavy shots from the top. And he turned it around into full guard. Swanson gets it back in his guard. 
Nice punch to the head from the top. There we go. He postures into place. He's working from full mount again. Swanson's got the back again. He's got him flat down on his back. There he goes. Back to mount again. And he's looking for an armbar. Almost had the armbar. Nice sweep. He's a full guard. And they're up. Head kick. Big power Come on, jam. Come on, come on. That's the end of round number one. Beautiful strike here. Lands on target. Here we see a beautifully timed kick. Connects flush. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. We really got a chance to see some awesome action in that round. Don't worry about anything. What I need you to do is stay with the technique. You're all right. You're all right. You've trained for this. You're going to be ready. You're ready for this. Carly getting us set for round two. Second round. The body shot blocked by Swanson. Oh, and he's down. And he's up. He's got heavy leg kicks. Up Good up cut. cut. Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising on his right side. Very good job of timing these shots here. Sprawl. Joe, nice knee to the body by the apex. Hit him with that straight left there. Both men exchanging. We take a look at the striking accuracy for the apex. Wow, that's a big head kick. He's got to be careful here. He's in trouble. A huge kick for the knockout victory. Time now for our fight replay. Let's take another look at the huge kick that caused the end of this fight. And you can see right here, as soon as it lands, this fight is over. Here's a different angle on it. Great angle here. Oh, man. K.O. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliano calls a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 20 seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout, the Apex. Victorious with the knockout.